Subscribe to the channel to motivate us to produce several videos and thank you from the bottom of my heart, Cape of Good Hope. The Cape of Good Hope is a rocky headland on the Atlantic coast of the Cape Peninsula region of South Africa. It is a significant landmark because it was once the point of departure for ships sailing to the east, including those attempting to reach the Indies and other Asian territories. It is often referred to as the Cape of Storms due to the treacherous winds and currents that have plagued ships making the journey around the Cape. The Cape of Good Hope is now a popular tourist destination and is part of the Table Mountain National Park. Park National Kruger The Kruger National Park is a large game reserve in northeastern South Africa, near the border with Mozambique. It was established in 1898 to protect the wildlife of the South African Lowveld and has since grown to become one of the largest game reserves in Africa, covering an area of over 19,000 square kilometers. The park is home to a diverse range of wildlife, including the Big Five, lion, leopard, elephant, buffalo, and rhinoceros, as well as many other species of mammals, birds, reptiles, and insects. Visitors to the park can participate in guided game drives, walks, and night drives to observe wildlife and experience the African bush. There are also several rest camps and lodges within the park that provide accommodation for visitors. The Kruger National Park is a popular tourist destination, attracting thousands of visitors each year from around the world. Hermanus Hermanus is a town in the Western Cape province of South Africa, located along the southern coast of the country. It is famous for its whale watching, as it is one of the best land-based whale watching locations in the world. During the southern hemisphere's winter months, southern right whales come close to shore to mate and give birth, and Hermanus provides excellent viewing opportunities. In addition to whale watching, Hermanus is also known for its scenic beauty, with rugged cliffs, pristine beaches, and abundant finbos vegetation. The town is surrounded by the Walker Bay Nature Reserve, which offers opportunities for hiking, birdwatching, and other outdoor activities. Hermanus is also a popular tourist destination for its wine, with several wineries and vineyards in the nearby Hemelenard Valley. Visitors to Hermanus can enjoy a range of activities, including whale watching, beach going, hiking, wine tasting, and shopping. The town is also a hub for outdoor and adventure sports such as kayaking, surfing, and rock climbing. Blyde River Canyon The Blyde River Canyon is a scenic canyon in Pumalanga Province, South Africa. It is one of the largest canyons in the world and is known for its dramatic scenery, including towering cliffs, lush vegetation, and crystal-clear rivers. The Blyde River Canyon is located within the Blyde River Canyon Nature Reserve, which covers an area of approximately 26,000 hectares. The Blyde River Canyon is home to a rich diversity of flora and fauna, including a number of endemic species found nowhere else in the world. Some of the most notable sites in the canyon include the Three Rondevels, a trio of huge, rounded rock formations that rise from the canyon floor, the Burke's Luck Potholes, a series of interconnected pools and waterfalls carved into the rock over millions of years, and God's Window, a scenic viewpoint that offers panoramic views of the surrounding landscape. Visitors to the Blyde River Canyon can take guided walks and hikes, go on scenic drives, or participate in outdoor activities such as fishing, horseback riding, and river rafting. There are also several lodges and campsites in the area, offering accommodation for those who want to spend more time exploring the canyon and its surroundings. Madik Madik Game Reserve is a large wildlife reserve located in the northwest province of South Africa, near the border with Botswana. Established in 1991, the reserve covers an area of approximately 75,000 hectares and is home to a diverse range of wildlife, including the Big Five, lion, leopard, elephant, buffalo, and rhinoceros, as well as many other species of mammals, birds, reptiles, and insects. Madik Game Reserve is known for its conservation efforts and its commitment to sustainable tourism. Visitors to the reserve can participate in guided game drives, walks, and night drives to observe wildlife and experience the African bush. There are also several lodges and campsites within the reserve that offer accommodation for those who want to spend more time exploring the area. Drakensburg 
Hedrakensberg is a mountain range located in the eastern part of South Africa, near the border with Lesotho. It is the highest mountain range in southern Africa and is known for its scenic beauty, including jagged peaks, rolling hills, and lush vegetation. The Drakensberg is also a popular destination for outdoor activities such as hiking, rock climbing, fishing, and horseback riding. The Drakensberg is home to a rich cultural heritage, including the largest concentration of rock art in Africa. The rock art, which is estimated to be over 2,000 years old, is a testament to the creativity and ingenuity of the indigenous people who lived in the area. The Drakensberg is also home to a number of natural attractions, including scenic waterfalls, crystal clear streams, and unique geological formations. Visitors to the Drakensberg can choose from a range of accommodation options, including lodges, campsites, and backpacking huts. The range is also a popular destination for adventure sports, such as paragliding, abseiling, and whitewater rafting. Whether you're looking for breathtaking scenery, rich cultural heritage, or outdoor adventure, the Drakensberg has something to offer for everyone. Wild Coast The Wild Coast is a term that is used to describe the rugged and largely undeveloped coastal region of South Africa, stretching from East London to the border with KwaZulu-Natal. It is known for its scenic beauty, with rolling hills, lush vegetation, and unspoiled beaches. The area is also home to several traditional Kosa villages and a rich cultural heritage. Despite its natural beauty, the Wild Coast has faced a number of challenges in recent years, including poverty, unemployment, and environmental degradation. Nevertheless, it remains a popular tourist destination and is valued by many South Africans for its unique natural and cultural resources. Table Mountain Table Mountain is a flat-topped mountain that overlooks the city of Cape Town, South Africa. It is one of the most iconic landmarks of the city and is considered to be one of the most famous tourist attractions in South Africa. The mountain stands 1,085 meters 3,563 feet tall and is part of the Table Mountain National Park, which covers an area of over 22,000 hectares. Table Mountain is known for its unique and diverse flora, with over 1,470 species of plants found on its slopes. The mountain is also a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts. With a variety of hiking trails that offer stunning views of the city and the surrounding countryside. The most famous of these trails is the Table Mountain Cableway, which takes visitors to the top of the mountain in a rotating cable car. Table Mountain is also of great cultural and spiritual significance to the indigenous people of the region, who have lived in the area for thousands of years. The mountain is revered as a sacred site and is considered to be a source of spiritual energy and inspiration. Pylanesburg National Park Pylanesburg National Park is a large wildlife reserve located in the northwest province of South Africa. It was established in 1979 and covers an area of approximately 55,000 hectares. The park is located within the extinct volcanic crater of the Pylanesburg, and its unique geography creates a diverse range of habitats that support a variety of wildlife species. Pylanesburg National Park is known for its big five game species, lion, elephant, leopard, buffalo, and rhino, as well as many other species such as cheetah, hyena, giraffe, zebra, and a variety of antelope and bird species. The park also features several archaeological sites, including the Thebae Diazzo dinosaurs' footprints, which are estimated to be between 200 and 300 million years old. Visitors to the park can participate in various activities, including game drives, hot air balloon rides, and guided walks. 
There are also several lodges and campsites within the park where visitors can stay. Heilensburg National Park is a popular destination for tourists. As it offers a unique combination of wildlife viewing, stunning landscapes, and cultural heritage. Vineyard Region The vineyard region refers to an area that is dedicated to the cultivation of grape vines for the production of wine. Some of the world's most famous vineyard regions are located in Europe, including the Champagne region in France, the Tuscany region in Italy, and the Rheingau region in Germany. In addition to Europe, there are also many well-known vineyard regions located in other parts of the world, such as Napa Valley in California, the Yarra Valley in Australia, and the Maple Valley in Chile. These regions are characterized by their unique climates, soil types, and winemaking traditions, which contribute to the distinct flavors and styles of the wines produced in each region. Visitors to vineyard regions can participate in a variety of activities, including wine tastings, vineyard tours, and wine and food pairings. Many vineyards also offer accommodation, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in the wine culture and enjoy the scenic surroundings, whether you're a wine connoisseur or simply looking for a unique travel experience. A visit to a vineyard region can be a memorable and enjoyable experience. Gansby Gansby is a small town located in the Western Cape province of South Africa. It is located along the coast and is known for its scenic beauty and abundant wildlife, including great white sharks and southern right whales. Gansby is widely regarded as one of the best places in the world for shark cage diving, and visitors can participate in this activity to get up close and personal with the great white sharks. In addition to shark cage diving, Gansby is also a popular destination for whale watching. As the nearby waters are home to a large population of southern right whales, which come to the area to calve and nurse their young, visitors to Gansby can also explore the town's many hiking trails and scenic beaches, or participate in activities such as kayaking, fishing, and scuba diving. There are also several lodges and hotels in the area where visitors can stay. Gansby is a unique and adventurous destination that offers a unique blend of natural beauty and wildlife encounters. Whether you're interested in sharks, whales, or simply looking for a scenic getaway, Gansby is definitely worth a visit. Outshorn Outshorn is a town located in the Western Cape province of South Africa. It is known for its ostrich farming industry, which has been a major part of the local economy for over a century. Visitors to Outshorn can learn about the history of the ostrich industry and its significance to the local economy by visiting one of the many ostrich farms in the area. These farms offer tours, shows, and even the opportunity to ride an ostrich. In addition to its ostrich farms, Outshorn is also known for its stunning natural beauty and cultural heritage. The nearby Kango Caves are a popular tourist attraction, featuring a network of limestone caves filled with impressive stalactites and stalagmites. The town is also home to several historical buildings and monuments, including the Outshorn Historical Museum and the Park Theron Nature Reserve. Visitors to Outshorn can also explore the surrounding countryside, including the Outaniqua Mountains and the Swartberg Pass, which offer stunning views and opportunities for hiking and outdoor activities. Outshorn is a unique and fascinating destination that offers a blend of natural beauty, cultural heritage, and modern industry. Whether you're interested in ostrich farming, history, or simply looking for a scenic getaway, Outshorn is definitely worth a visit. Wilderness The term wilderness refers to an undeveloped and natural area of land, usually associated with rugged terrain and a lack of human development or infrastructure. It is often used to describe areas that are remote, rugged, and relatively untouched by human activities. Some people view wilderness as a place of peace, beauty, and adventure, while others may see it as a challenging environment to be conquered. In any case, Wilderness areas are often considered to be important ecosystems, playing a crucial role in supporting the balance of nature and a variety of species. Many wilderness areas are protected by law, with some designated as national parks or wilderness areas, and are managed by government agencies or conservation organizations to ensure their preservation for future generations. <laughs>